hello friends so once again welcome back to my channel so guys today i'm going to show you that uh, how you can install and set up kali linux on your android device so to install kali linux you will firstly need a app named net hunter store so the download link for this app is given in description just download from there and after that you have to open this And this is the official app which is used to download Kali Net Hunter and its terminal. So download this app and uh, after opening this app you will see here Net Hunter terminal. So firstly you need to download this because this is needed before installing the main APK. So you have to download and uh, install this one firstly. so we have successfully installed this after this you need to click uh, here you can see net hunter kali linux so this you need to click on this and uh, here you can see net hunter by kali, kali linux so just click on install here and download this one also now just install it So we have installed this also as you can see. So after installing this you can see here we have installed uh, these two applications successfully. Kali Linux and its terminal. So now you can install the store apk <laughs> so after this you need to firstly install busybox on your magisk app so open magisk and here go in module section and install busybox here you can see i have already installed busybox so the link for busybox is given in description just you have to select that and click on install from storage and navigate to the file which you have downloaded and just flash that and reboot once just simple as we flash a magisk mod same process so flash this and this should be installed to run kali linux because this is required to run it so as you can see we have successfully installed and now we can just open kali linux so as we open this we have to allow some permissions to it so maybe it may crash uh, first few times so you need to reopen it and allow the other per permissions too it will ask for root permissions also so you will have to allow that too so after doing all this you can see here the box is installed so this needs to be installed and here you can see it is saying to set up so as I click on the three dots uh, on the left side here you can see all the tools provided by it here you can see I am clicking on them but they are not working so you need to set it up before before using it so just uh, click on Kali CS root manager to set it up so as you will click on this uh, a script will run here you can see that at least 8 GB of free internal storage should be there so that your system won't break so make sure that you have this uh, amount of memory free after that you need to click on install Kali CH root so click here so from here you need to click on download latest or if you have downloaded from other sources like uh, Chrome or any other browser then you need to click on restore so you need to click on download because uh, i think you haven't downloaded it from anywhere so here you can see full and minimum so let me tell you one thing that uh, 
full one contains all the tools which are included in this and the minimum one uh, does not provide all the tools so i will recommend you full one to download and install so as we select full one and uh, from here it will automatically select your architecture so no need to change that and if you want minimum one you can try that also but uh, let me tell you one thing that uh, the full one uh, is of about uh, 1800 mb so make sure that uh, that much of data is available to you and uh, the minimum one is about 900 mb so make sure that much of data you have with you so i have already downloaded it so i will restore from local storage so as i click on restore from local storage i need to click ok here so in yours it will download first and after that uh, the script which is running in mine it will uh, run on yours also because uh, after download uh, it extract uh, the file which is downloaded and uh, it extract and set up the tools for you so the process starts from here you can see so in your download complete will be here and after that it will be the same message as it's here so it will take about 10 to 15 minutes and uh, it can take more also and less also according to your depends on your device processor also so you need to wait for 10 to 15 minutes here so i will be skipping this portion so as you can see a voice status above it's showing kali ch root is not yet installed so now as you can see it has finished extracting its file and setting up its tool so now we have successfully installed kali ch root and uh, you can see our status above that Kali CH root has not yet started. So we have installed it. We just need to start it now. So now to start it just click on start Kali CH root and it will automatically starts. So now our all tools has been activated here you can see that all the tools are available here bad USB MIT MITx there are many attacks uh, you will be knowing some of them. So there is uh, also attacks for Wi-Fi like uh, Mana Wireless Toolkit WPS attack below here you can see WPS attacks and there are uh, many tools and you can also uh, use custom commands to attack or uh, take any action through this app uh, for which uh, the Termux has been already downloaded and you can also change your uh, MAC address through your MAC changer here this will uh, send your random mac to a router so that it cannot track your device so there are many uh, tools so that cannot be explained in this video uh, i will be making separate video on that so please wait for that till then and do subscribe our channel so after you start uh, you need to stop it when you have uh, used tools so that uh, it won't run in background so here you can see stop Kali CH root you just need to click on stop so it will stop its services and here you can see the tools has been automatically disabled so you can start it from here 
again it will not require any data no more so just click on start to start and uh, stop it when you have used the tools so that's all for today do subscribe our channel like this video and uh, share if you want to share to someone thanks for watching